Hi there, this is Jennifer with Brome Fields, and today we're going to create, uh, start on the easiest triangle shawl ever. Uh, I like to start with one stitch. So I'm using Lion Brand Woolies Thick and Quick Yarn, and I'm using size 11 knitting needles. And I have a 24 inch cable on it. Um, you could start uh, shorter or longer. Um, it will get pretty wide. A 32 or even a 40 inch would probably be good. It just depends on how wide you want to, to make it. So to get started, we're going to make a knot and create a loop. So that's our one first stitch. All right, so for our first row, so that's just our cast on, we're gonna cast on one stitch. So row one, we're going to increase a stitch. So I used a backwards loop and we want that to be kind of tight. And I hold my tail back here. So I keep that, that first stitch tight also, and it stays in place. And we're gonna knit that one stitch. And then we're going to do a backwards loop again to increase the stitch. So now we have three stitches on our needle. And then, so that was row one. Row two, in every even row, you're just gonna knit. We're just gonna knit all of the stitches. So that was row two. Row three, we're going to increase a stitch. So all odd rows, we're going to increase. And we're gonna increase on the right and left side at the front and back or beginning and end. And you want it a little tight. We're gonna knit those stitches in the middle. Create another backwards loop, pull it tight. And now we're ready for row four, which is all knit stitches. And you should usually have, no, you should always have an odd number of stitches. Two, three, four, five. If you don't, that means you only increased on one side or the other which could create a lopsided triangle. So you do have to be careful to make sure that you increase in on both sides on one row, all of the odd rows. So we increased, now we're gonna knit everything in between the two increased stitches. So it is kind of easy to tell where you're at. So this one's easy to pick up and put down because you can tell that that is an increased stitch and not a knit stitch. So you know what row you're working on. So we increased one. Oops. We're gonna knit everything in the middle. All right, so we increased on the previous row. So we didn't increase there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So now you want to increase a stitch. So that's a knit stitch or a purl actually on this side. So now we're going to increase a stitch, knit everything in the middle. And increase the stitch. So that means on the next row, you're just going to knit all the stitches. So that is the pattern to create a triangle shawl. So you cast on one stitch, you increase two stitches, and then you knit. Increase two, knit, increase two. And you follow that pattern until it's as big as you want it to be. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching.